Welcome to Math 107 everybody and well done for getting started. Um, so in this video I'm just going to give you a quick overview of the course and then I'd like you to go through and complete all of the tasks in the orientation and then take the orientation quiz. All right. So um, it looks might look daunting but just remember that you'll essentially be doing three things every day video notes textbook homework and a quiz they're the three most important things and if you can figure out how to do that um you'll you'll do fine so here's a typical day this is section 3.1 uh, we're going to click on a video we're going to write down the examples we're going to do this textbook homework uh, that's listed here then we're going to take this quiz and that's it right um, so let me go over those three things in, in more detail. So I actually have one, two, three videos. So I'm going to uh, play this video, put it in full screen, write down the examples, then do these textbook homework questions. Then I'll play this video, put it in full screen, um, write down those examples on paper, and then do these textbook homework questions, and then do this video and these textbook homework questions, and so on, right? And then I'll take a quiz, right? So what does that mean? So if I click on this, the video opens up, I should go click on the bottom right to put it in full screen, okay? And um, I'm going to just follow along the video as, it, as if you were in class, but don't sit there and watch it. I would like you to write down exactly, or what I'm writing down. Um, so, um, and do all of the examples, not just the first example, do all of the examples in the videos. And when you're done with that, then do the textbook homework question. Uh, and just remember that every student, almost every student I've had who has written down all of the video examples has passed easily. So that's e definitely the most important part of the class is the, the video notes. All right. Um, sometimes I give you the, uh, you can click here to find the actual um, worksheets that have the examples on them. And if you have a printer, that's great. You can print that out. But if you don't have a printer, that's fine. Just write down the the work for it on paper. You don't even have to write out the questions on paper. Just just read the questions off the um, off the screen and just write down, say, example four, and then just show the work. You know what I mean? So so that's the videos, right? Um, anything else? Okay, so moving on to textbook homework. Um, hopefully you have a textbook. If you don't, um, I have the first, at least the first week or two of homework online for free here. So click on that page, text, no textbook yet page to find out. Um, the odd numbered answers will be in the back of the book and the quizzes usually check even numbered answers. So make sure you're checking your answers as you're going along to make sure, you're, make sure you're doing things correctly. So always check your odd numbers in the back. And when you're doing your textbook homework, make sure you write down your work. Show the work that you need to do to get the answer. I'm the teacher, so I'm gonna show all of the steps in case anyone needs to see each particular step in a problem. As a student, you may not write down as many steps as I do, that's fine, but whatever work you need to do to get the answer, please write it on paper and please show it clearly. And when you're done with the video notes and textbook homework, then you take the quiz. So you just click here and you take the quiz. And a quiz will often ask you to uh, type in the answer to a particular homework question. So like question seven, uh, you know, it's asking you for answers for that question, question eight and, and nine and so on. So the, qu the, the quiz will often just ask you to type in your answers that you already got to the textbook homework questions, all right? Um, and so let me show you what that looks like. So here's some students work um, and you don't have to use the same colored pen but this is some student work here on paper. Here's some other students work here on paper. Okay, so th this is this is particularly neat. Now the work is shown very nicely here, and it's labeled well, so I can read it. Like 3.2 textbook, um, 3.1 video, and it's good. Uh, we'll sh we'll talk about the schedule soon, but it's good to sh uh, turn in the schedule so I can see that as well. All right. Um, so that's what I'm talking about about uh, writing your work on paper, and we'll talk about turning it in in, in a sec. Um, 
anything else around here well sometimes there'll be graph paper that you can use you're not required to print it but if you have a printer that's great if not just try to use some type of grid paper if we're if we're doing graphs um, there are sometimes discussions um, if there's an answer that requires you to write something out as an English sentence or two or a paragraph in English please don't write down on paper please look for the discussion link type in your opinion here and then check back to see uh, what your classmates wrote if, uh, and see if you guys are trying to work together to figure out the answer to these things so don't don't just post and leave it just come back and say hey I wondered I wondered did what I wrote make sense or check some of your classmates answers and see if that makes sense okay and so then you can get help from your classmates and homework sharing you click here I might have some answers they might have some answers below we'll talk about that um, you can get math help um, so go through this page we'll talk about that soon math help is you know video homework there's homework sharing you can email me you can give me a call we'll get on zoom zoom and I can shoot you with a live video okay but that's a typical day that's typical day. but once again it's just mainly just video notes textbook homework quiz and out of those three the most important thing to do is the video notes okay okay so let's go to the orientation I would like you to do all of the orientation um, so you know get the syllabus uh, get the schedule make sure you've got the textbook and and so on and like for each of these I've actually made a little video to go over each thing in detail so so this talks about the textbook is a couple of minutes long um, and so on right and here's math help and if you get to math help just watch the first video that pops up it talks about math help right so but I want you to go through each of these things in the orientation to make sure you're well prepared for the class and at the end you're going to take an orientation quiz right and we'll also um, you'll show up hopefully to uh, a, a little zoom meeting we'll have in week one to go over instructions for the course or um, you can if you can't make that you can just give me a phone call okay uh, and hopefully choose there Wednesday of week one for a phone call that'd be good right um, so anything else to talk about let's see the video notes are required um, Yeah, I think we've got it. So I hope you enjoyed the course and um, we'll talk to you soon.